It's on. You, it, it is late, and you do, you do not need to be barking, young man. You've been over here huffing, and your body's been bouncing. Oh, okay. He's pissed. You know why? Because we took away his bully stick. That's what it is. He's upset that we took away his bully stick, but you were going to choke on it. And he went over to the trash can. Where it is? Oh, Reuben? Hey, no, no, it's late. You're not getting another bully stick. Damn it, dog. Hey, you're not getting another one. You're not getting another one. Come lay down. Let's go. No, we're all done. We're all done with bully sticks tonight. It's late. It's late. Again, trying to push him along. He's saying, no, no thank you. There we go. You're not getting, no. You're not getting another one. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Ruben. No. I know that's not a bully stick. I get it. <laughs> yes, you were. I, look, that's that was exactly where you you were munching on it. I understand it was delicious. However, Reuben, however, you're not getting another one because you had chewed it into a, a monster pile of nastiness, and you started to choke on it. No, 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 sir. What I need you to do is to gather yourself and get control of yourself of your emotions. <coughs> okay. You are an, <coughs> you are an adult dog. You're not a toddler. Now I want you to calm down. You want to come up on the chair? Get you up on the chair. I'll get you up on the chair here. Here we go. No, it's not up. It's not hiding up here. Sit your bottom down. Let's have a conversation about this. Let's have a conversation about this, Ruben. Okay? Real quick. Real quick. You had a good time, didn't you? Okay. But you can't chew on that all night long, can you? No. No, you can't. You can't chew on it all night long. You know why? Because you have to go to bed. Oh! Okay, Reuben. We give you almost everything you ask for. What we're asking from you is a little bit of silence. Just some silence, okay? A little bit of peace. It's very late. People are sleeping. So, we will get you another one tomorrow, but not, to, not, not tonight. Okay, Ruben, you're gonna make me pull up my stern voice, and you know I don't care. I I don't care to use my stern voice on you, nor do you. So let's just calm ourselves. If you need to chew on my finger under the blanket. Go ahead and do that. You need to get your energy out. It's not the same as a bully stick, I understand. Doesn't smell and or taste the same way. But if this if this gets out your aggression, this is what we do. Carol, I imagine this is how uh, parents these days uh, talk to their children. Instead of just telling them to sit down and shut up. They reason with them and they tell them that they're lovely, lovely children. 
but they need to really get a grip. Okay. He's getting a grip on my knuckles. Ouch, Reuben. Okay. Okay. All right. Nice work. So what we're saying with, with all of this, this, uh, this excitement is that he's a big fan of bully sticks. He gets them ramped up and we now have to regulate when we get him them because this is the result that he goes a little bananas. Okay, Ruben. <laughs> this is a bit much. This is we okay. We thought maybe you'd burned off some energy. Apparently not. Let's chew on a little more. Chew on a little bit more. I have never in my life had to spend so many calories in appeasing a dog or cat or hamster. Anything. You are as high maintenance as they come. People, if you are thinking of getting a bulldog and you don't have a lot of time to spend with them, I mean all your spare time, you might want to reconsider and get yourself perhaps, I don't know, a fern, maybe a goldfish. Okay, no, okay, no, no, no. Ruben, look, it's 9.37 at night. We have a, we have a calming fire on the television, even though it's summertime. I, look, the entire mood for this evening has been calm, calm, calm and peace and you have upset it. you have upset the balance Ruben here's the thing no here's the thing if you need to get out your aggression why don't you put it down in why don't you write it down in your feelings journal why don't you write it down in your you're gonna, okay, strong words for your feelings journal, I get it. Use your indoor voice, not your outdoor voice, okay? Okay, Ruben, we're gonna put the camera down here and we're gonna, we are gonna have a talk away from everyone else and we're gonna get together, we're gonna, we're gonna gather ourselves, okay? Very disappointed in how you've acted this evening. You're, you did it all in front of your mother as well. She didn't have to see this, but she did. <laughs> oh, do, oh, oh, you. Oh. Carol, we're going to have a talk about the child. Yeah.